I'm Stacy Carter. I'm an assistant professor in the Division of Surgical Oncology in the Department of Surgery at Baylor College of Medicine. I was born in the Houston area. I grew up here. I went away to California for college. I came back to Texas. I went to the University of Texas Health Science Center at San Antonio for medical school. And then I did my general surgery training at Baylor College of Medicine and then I did my breast surgical oncology training at MD Anderson Cancer Center. Breast cancer is a very common diagnosis. One out of every eight women will be diagnosed with breast cancer in their lifetime, which is about a 12% risk. In some women, the risk of breast cancer is higher because they have a family history of breast cancer or they have a genetic mutation that puts them at higher lifetime risk of breast cancer, sometimes up to 40 to 80%. Breast cancer is a very personal diagnosis. It's a very emotional time for a woman. Um, the breast is a lot of the identity of a woman, and so it's important to take all of those factors into consideration. One of my goals as a surgical oncologist is first to do no harm in that we want to find a surgical procedure that is oncologically safe, and we want to remove all of the cancer. My second goal is to really listen to the woman and see what it is that is important to her. In some women, it's breast conservation. and other women, it's to remove the entire breast. But I think the important part of the decision is that it rests on the patient. It rests on you.